Good afternoon guys and happy Monday to all of your sunshiny faces. Guys, I got laundry done first thing this morning. I made dinner today too, which is like a pretty good thing because um, I haven't really been waking up early enough to like do like a slow cooker dinner. Um, so I did yesterday and today because um, I was up early enough to do that. Although I actually just made pulled um, or like chicken sandwich, barbecue chicken sandwiches. The chicken doesn't really normally take that long to cook and um yesterday i did tacos which also the taco meat like doesn't normally take very long to cook um so they weren't ones i need to be real early up or up real early for in the morning um you know to put those in the slow cooker but i did wind up doing that like i said today and yesterday and um we actually had a ton of the chicken like the barbecue chicken left over so I'm actually thinking that we'll probably wind up doing leftovers for tomorrow or guys. What I had one time with my cousins was Domino's apparently. Um, well, no, maybe it was Pizza Hut. Um, one place they ended up stopping at. Actually, they came to come and pick me up one year for like spring break when I was in high school. And they actually got um, like barbecued chicken like pizza. Um, and I thought it was like so good. I'd actually never had it before because really nobody in my house I think would eat it. Um, well not that they wouldn't eat it, but it wouldn't be something like that they'd order, you know, like on purpose. Um, like Jack is like a sausage person across the board. Matthew all of a sudden has become a pineapple and um, like ham and pineapple or um type of person and um I don't know where that started that was honestly just like the last few years he's like become like that type of person I don't know I actually used to eat it a lot too when I was real little um I remember the first time I had it too because my parents never ordered it because I don't think either of them like it but um I went over to my friend's house and her um her parents made like themselves like a pineapple a ham and pineapple pizza and for us they made us just like a cheese pizza and um so it was actually we were i was like well i like ham and i like pineapple i was like can i try a piece of yours and then we were like real little like maybe like five or six years old or something like that we ended up eating all of their pizza and they winded up with the cheese pizza because we apparently loved it so much i just remember and that was like the first time that i'd ever had it and so um it was like i said really good and i actually liked it ever since like pretty much then on um but uh yeah so the the barbecue chicken like sandwich um or barbecue yeah barbecue chicken sandwich chicken pizza um barbecue chicken pizza i think we got like i said maybe from pizza hut or from like Domino's or something like that and so I actually think maybe that like we might get some um if we have like that much leftovers to kind of like still reuse it maybe do like get some of the like cheese like pizza or not cheese pizza but they have the pizza like dough stuff from Aldi um and like the pre-made stuff and maybe just do like a pizza of that or something like that and then do like one cheese for like me and whoever else wants it um but like I said the one time I had it it was really good and I've always been like you know you can put that on pizza like you can pretty much put anything on pizza guys <laughs> like anything that you want like you want a garlic pizza you can put garlic on there I mean that's kind of a given for a lot of people um is that like some type of garlic is normally winds up being added into pizza whether it's in like the crust or the sauce or you know whatever but you know you add peppers and olives and people do anchovies right um and like I said you can do ham and pineapple um like Hawaiian pizza and you can do um like I said barbecue chicken so um yeah like I said though it's not that I don't think anybody in our house would eat it I actually think they'd like it it's just that that's not normally something that we'd like we're kind of basic in our pizzas like pepperoni cheese or sausage like we'll wind up getting one of those i used to be a big pepperoni person but ever since i stopped eating meat obviously <laughs> i've been just a cheese person so um yeah and jack's normally sausage my dad's sausage and probably like i said matthew's like hawaiian no mom will normally like wind up she likes to have like other types of vegetables on her she actually doesn't really like like sausage or pepperoni pizza um she'll either have cheese or else if she does she'll wind up getting something with like mushrooms or um green peppers or like you know something like garlicky you know kind of thing like a veggie type of pizza or something like that so if she gets that like that that's what I have and like I said depends on where we're going because some places we might wind up getting like they might not even have what we want at some different places or whatever but 
like I said, for the most part, that's kind of like how we, <laughs> our pizzas are pretty basic. Um, if we ever go with anything super exciting, that's normally the extent of it. But um, like I said, Matthew's normally like a Hawaiian person, pineapple, pa Hawaiian pizza person now, which is again, kind of weird because we'd never like we, we didn't grow up on that you know what I mean so it was like something that he like developed just recently and I honestly my dad hates pineapple he really is not a fan of pineapple um so that's probably why too we didn't really ever have that um but anyways though that's what I was thinking guys for dinner maybe either tomorrow or maybe else on what is that Wednesday um because I do have somewhere I need to go tomorrow afternoon so like I said we'll see if um I actually I don't know it might be like right when I have to actually like make dinner so I don't think that making like pizza in the slow cooker would be the best timing for that um <laughs> I'm not making pizza in the slow cooker guys I don't think it'd be a good time for me to make pizza in the oven with the barbecue chicken that I made in the slow cooker today um so yeah but like I said there's like a lot leftovers probably like half of it and so I don't want to waste that much um and my dad already took one for lunch too so like maybe i can try and convince jack to have one for like once he gets home from school tomorrow but like other than that maybe we'll just do leftovers too um because there's also some ground beef left over from the tacos on yesterday we grilled too on friday and saturday everybody pretty much wound up eating all of that stuff so we don't have any of that left over but i'm trying to be frugal guys and like kind of like use what we have so even if it is though too like that's one thing that i i been trying to do and maybe should try and do a little bit more often but like if we have leftovers try and figure out a way to incorporate it into another meal like I said with like the barbecue chicken like okay we can do sandwiches again for another like leftover night or whatever but um you know especially if it's cold too like the putting it over pizza you're heating it back up in the oven you know so it's warm and everything like that if not you have to get other people to like warm it up and sometimes they're just like honestly I don't know why some people are so lazy in our house like heating stuff up is too much of a chore for people to do like I cook meals and stuff like that and still like somebody that has to heat up soup you know from a can they're like can somebody else do this for me I'm like really like <laughs> you can't even do that for yourself um like seriously like Jack will be like what's for dinner I'm like oh like you know we didn't have anything planned or something like that I was like oh you know it's either leftovers or like make something yourself and he's like I'll have a pop tart I'm like okay there's stuff other things in the cabinet there's leftovers in the fridge like don't just eat a pop tart and he's like well then can you make me a can of soup I'm like you put it in a bowl and you put it in the microwave for however long like even if you don't you just kind of do the guesswork you're like two minutes you know whatever um unless you're like me and don't like it heat it up in the microwave in which case you heat it up in a little saucepan on the stove and then once it starts bubbling up you know it's done and it's nice and warm so like i said guys i don't know why this is so difficult for some people but um it's like i have to be like the like the nanny that has to like spoon feed people their actual food and like make it for them um <laughs> like i said sometimes sometimes it's frustrating um so yeah but actually though I don't really do that like my mom is like the type of person where like if she made something and like let's say she makes pork chops right and there's only like four pork chops or whatever five four pork chops I guess um because I won't have a pork chop but like for everybody else right so she'll put one pork chop on everybody's plate and then like if she made sides or whatever and stuff like that so that like everybody knows like there wasn't like leftovers or anything like that whereas like normally when I cook I'm like take as much as you want or as little as you want whereas my mom will normally like wind up making plates for people um and like normally we're like when I cook it's normal and just like my mom doesn't do that too often but like I said sometimes she'll like wind up like applesauce and like whatever like if she's doing like a vegetable or whatever and or you know like I said like pork chop and stuff like that depending on again what she's making or like if it's chicken or whatever but she'll normally like wind up like kind of rationing it out so that like everybody has like enough food if that makes sense um and like fixes plates for everybody um but like I said it's normally just the five of us so it's not like she's like doing it for like a whole bunch of people so um that's just not normally how I wind up cooking but 
Anyways, so guys, yeah, I edited two vlogs for today. I also got some laundry done first thing this morning, and um, I think I was telling you guys that, and that's when I got into the whole food thing and was talking about food. But yeah, I think it is a good, like that whole, you know, reusing what you already have so that you're not recycling it, but you know, you're utilizing what would just be leftovers and maybe it doesn't wind up getting eaten or whatever into like another meal, like doing it on pizza, even though it's something super simple and super fast and maybe not the healthiest, but like just reusing something that you had obviously way too much of um because I don't really want to refreeze it um so like I said I'm gonna try and maybe do that because Matthew was also asking too about doing kale flatbreads again which we used to do a lot and I haven't a bought kale recently and b like had the capability or men mental capacity to be able to make those recently but he's been asking for them a lot so maybe I'll get that too but we'd have to stop at Aldi and maybe we'll do that tomorrow when I get back from where I have to go so um but I won't make it tomorrow so anyways I'll see you guys all in tomorrow's vlog if you guys did enjoy today's make sure you guys give a big old thumbs up if you guys are new we'd love if you'd subscribe and I'll see all of your sunshiny faces tomorrow so bye guys